Some people fear spiders, others fear heights, but imagine you have phobia of everything. The year is 1938. Roy Plunkett, a young chemist at DuPont, is tasked with developing a new refrigerant gas, something safer than ammonia. He set up what should be a routine experiment, but when he opens the pressurized cylinder, the gas is gone. Strangely, the container still feels heavy, so he cuts it open and sees white powder. Nothing very exciting at first, but Roy just accidentally discovered Teflon, the most slippery material that we know. And here comes the interesting part. Teflon isn't slippery because it's smooth, like glass. It's slippery because of its chemistry. Unlike long hydrocarbon chains found in fats, Teflon's carbon backbone is not covered by hydrogen, but fluorine atoms. Thanks to fluorine's unique properties, this creates a surface that refuses to interact with any other molecules. We can demonstrate this with a heavy load, something so massive it takes superhuman effort just to get it moving. But the moment we place it on a Teflon surface, it slides effortlessly. Even a gecko, the ultimate climbing specialist, can't grab onto a Teflon. Teflon's phobia is so strong that the chains don't even interact with each other. That's why Teflon tape stretches easily in one direction, but stays tough and unyielding in the other. All of this because one chemist didn't stop at nothing's there and got curious. Teflon, not just nonstick, chemically untouchable, used everywhere. 